Hey everyone, I'm very excited for this week's video. It's been a video I've wanted to do for a very long time, and that is build a life-size maze for the pet raccoons. Now, this video uh, is really expensive to make because it was made completely out of plywood, so if you would like to help out the channel, be sure to like the video and comment below. Also, if you would like to support the channel in another way, go to titotheraccoon.com and pick up a Piper original masterpiece. But anyways, let's get to it. All right, everyone, so this is our maze. Here we have it, as you can see. Oh, I just knocked one down. Let's see, there you go. Okay, so essentially, I just plotted this all out using, um, you know, shipping boxes. All these boxes will be used in the future, so none of it's going to waste. Um, but I thought it would be better than tape because one, I didn't have tape. Second of all, like it allows me to get a better feel for the maze. And so I really liked how it turned out actually. So essentially what's gonna happen is we're gonna have like an entrance like right here, somewhere along this little area, and then an exit right here. But anyways, that's essentially the maze. What we wanna do now is um, turn these boxes into plywood, just kinda like we built these walls. And the only unfortunate part about this maze is it's so tall. You have to film exactly straight down to see the whole maze. And the only way we can do that is by somehow taping like the camera up so it shines straight down on the maze so we can get a view like that. But with that being said, um, we're gonna go ahead and turn this into plywood instead of these little boxes. But anyways, let's go ahead and get to it.
So the maze ended up taking a lot longer than we anticipated. So we're going to have Piper and Cheeto try out the maze next week. And who knows, we might have some guest stars. But anyways, thanks again guys for watching. Be sure to check out the links in the description. And until next time, we'll see you later.